Bougie Two Feather Nation, this is Beer for Two Feathers, and welcome to Blameless. And as you guys can see, there's the continue thing can be lit up. I uh, tried to do this video earlier, and my mic wasn't plugged in all the way actually wasn't plugged in at all so you can see it so let's uh, try a new game yeah start new and I figured it out at the beginning of the at, around the beginning of the video I didn't see my mic uh, light up house that he was building. I always okay. respected people who could do construction, so I naturally agreed to come and take a look. Okay. I already had a couple of ideas. It was already quite late, but he insisted on me coming over the same day. I tried to comply, because I didn't want to lose this offer. I drove there with my car. His house yeah. was all the way over in the suburban area, quite remote, but with other houses nearby, quiet place. The man met me okay. at the front gate. It was a temporary fence, and the gate was made of rotting wooden planks. He started showing me around the yard. It seemed yeah. weird that there was a large garbage container blocking the way, so we had to okay. go through the garage to get inside the house. He took me through the rooms, so I started looking around. At one point, I saw a stain. Ooh. At first glance, it seemed like brick dust, but then I realized it was blood spilled on the floor. I thought that there was another worker who got injured, so I turned to tell <laughs> yeah. him. That's when I saw his hand raised to hit me. He was holding a metal rod. Before I could defend myself, he hit me in the head. I must have passed out. I don't know how long I was out. <sighs> when I woke up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, that's uh, uh phone. It's my phone. Sweet. I think. Yeah. Uh ho ho. <laughs> phone is smashed. Okay. That's not what I want to hear. I want to hear how I can get the hell out of here. This blood stain does not look like it's the result of banal injury. It seems fresh. Blood hasn't completely dried out yet. Better look some more. This looks like something was being dragged across the blood stain. Oh, that was me! Oh. Uh, okay. Um, okay, that's, uh, okay, this feels good, okay, let's close that, and, <laughs> that's fine, I, I was already going past this part. Uh, I was already a little bit past this part, so, that's, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, like I said, I was already a little past this part when I discovered my mic was off. Shit, it's dark. What the hell was that? There we go. Okay. Hey! Your wallet! 
Come on. Okay. Whew. Okay. Ooh, scary shit right now, guys. Okay. Okay, uh, that's. I was at around this part when I started to quit. The first. Ooh! Yeah! Haha! <laughs> Hell yeah! Let's clip these wires. Okay. Yeah, I'm outside. Sweet. Okay, let's go through here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, it's hitting the fan, guys. Hello? Huh? You SOB. Okay. What's in here? Ah! Damn it, quit loading. Okay. No. The fuse box opener is locked in the old house in my duffel bag. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your helpful advice. Okay. I don't like the look of that dark corridor. <laughs> Hey, it's working. Huh. Oh. Is that... Is there a light in here? Oh, there's not, but... What the hell? Whoa! What the hell? Okay. Oh, what a horrible sound. What's the address of this house? Was she invited here too? Oh, my God. Okay. Uh. 
I'm kind of scared to turn around. Okay. Nothing happened to me yet. <laughs> oh, wait, I turned around. A flashlight. Okay. Okay, I found a useful tool. I'm outside. Finally out of the house. Okay, good. Okay, it's already getting a little scarier. <laughs> like I said, I've never really played it, a game like this before. Okay, let's open up this door. Ooh. Okay. That's ah, broken. Thirteen July two thousand one. Subject Final Reminder Letter Dear Mr. Hopkins. This is to inform you that, according to our records, as of 12 July 2001, we still haven't received back the scaffolding or the three suspension ladders you borrowed from the Deirdre Construction Stores on 7 June of this year. Please okay. return the scaffolding within 14 days upon receiving this letter. Should you choose to ignore this appeal, we will be passing this matter to a collection company, which will be obliged to forcibly remove the scaffolding from your possession. To cover any fees or penalties, incurred by such action will be your sole responsibility. Okay. Note, you will not receive any more reminder letters from us. Yours sincerely, Anna Catwell, Account Manager. <laughs> okay. Whew. That's pretty light. Damn. Is there anything else in here I could use? Can I open up? I don't want to see what's in here. Damn it all. Here's the other one. Where's. He said there's three scaffolding 
ladders. I only saw the one. Uh. Locked. <laughs> okay. Oh, here's the other one. Okay. This is the way out. Yeah. Or, 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 this is the way out. This could possibly be a way out. It is. Okay. Let's go up here. Get away from me! Get away from me! Screw you! <laughs> that scares the shit out of me. There he is. Wait, what? This is my water place. Stay where you are. You're under arrest. What? Get down on your knees. But I didn't do anything. Get on your knees now! But I didn't do anything. Yeah. The rod in his hand. He must have hidden when he saw the police <laughs> cars pulling up to the gate. Yeah, I didn't do nothing. Mr. Malcolm, we searched the yard thoroughly and didn't find any evidence suggesting there was another man. What? No, 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 no. He was there. He was the owner who called me. The former owners sold the house due to personal financial problems two weeks ago. They moved to a different town on the other side of the country. The private company who owns it now proved all their employees were off-site, having a team building activity that night. Okay. How could you not find evidence of him? I'm telling you, he was there. I heard you. Our officers got a phone call from one of the neighbors reporting lights coming on in the house and suspicious person moving on site. They gave us your description. They never saw another man. What? How could that be? This doesn't make any sense. Let's I... cut the crap. What? It does make pretty clear sense to me. I have to say that I honestly don't believe any part of your bullshit story that you're giving. Bullshit? Me. Everything suggests How that dare you? That woman. Wait, what? Oh, I found the victim's blood on your clothes and your hands. You had the victim's wallet in your pocket. Wait. And the officers caught you fleeing the crime scene. You. No one else. Guess whose fingerprints match the ones we found on the victim's body? Huh? Wait, what? You're going down, Mr. Blameless. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I never expected that to be the ending. So, and I'm pretty sure there is multiple endings so thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you liked it make sure you shoot the like button in the ass with an arrow and nagash